Hi, in our earlier videos we have learnt about prime numbers and we have also learnt how to find the prime numbers between any two given numbers. And in this video we are going to learn about co-prime numbers, twin prime numbers and we are also going to learn about prime triplets, right? So what is a prime number? A prime number is a number which has only two factors. One is one, the number one and another factor is the number itself, right? So other than one and number itself, it doesn't have any other factor. Such numbers are called prime numbers. And what are composite numbers? Composite numbers are the numbers which can be represented as the product of two or more numbers. That means a composite number will have factors other than one and the number itself, right? So if any number which has factors other than one and the number itself, it is called composite number, right? So what is co-prime number? Co-prime numbers is actually a set of two natural numbers having no common factors other than one. So any two numbers like three and four, where this three is a prime number, but this four is actually a composite number, right? But together, if I write three and four, they don't have any common factor. The factors of three are one and three. And if I talk about the factors of four, the factors of four are one, two and four, right? So if I see the list of the factors of both three and four, they have only one common factor, right? Which is one. So three and four will be called co-prime numbers. Then you can have numbers like 12 and 13. 12 is an even number, but 13 is an odd number and at the same time it is a prime number also, right? But there are no common factors between 12 and 13. So 12 and 13 will also be called as co-prime numbers. And now let me take one more example. Suppose if I take eight and 15, the factors of 8 are 1 is the factor of all the numbers. Then if I try to write other factors of 8, they will be 2, 4 and 8. And if I write the set of all the factors of 15, of course 1 will be there. Then we'll have 3. Then we'll have 5. And after that, we'll have 15. Right? And now if we see these two sets and search for the common factors, we have only one common factor which is 1. Right? But if we see them independently, this 8 is a composite number because it can be written as 4 multiplied by 2 or 2 multiplied by 4 or 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 2. This 15 is also a composite number. This can be written as 3 multiplied by 5. Right? So, if we see them individually, both of them are composite numbers, but together they are co-prime because they don't have any factor other than one common in them, right? So this group of eight and five, this is also called set of co-prime numbers, right? So now you understood what is co-prime number? Co-prime numbers is actually a set of two natural numbers having no common factors other than one. So those two numbers can individually be either prime numbers or they can be composite numbers but between themselves they don't have any common factor other than one, right? So they are called co-prime numbers, okay? And now let's talk about twin prime numbers. So what is twin prime numbers? Twin prime numbers is actually a set of two prime numbers having difference of two. So that means any consecutive two prime numbers which have difference of two can be called twin prime numbers. Suppose three and five, both of them are prime numbers, right? And at the same time, they have difference of two between them. So they will be called twin prime numbers. And if I talk about five and seven, they are also called twin prime numbers because both of them are prime numbers and they have difference of two between them, right? And if I talk about 11 and 13, this group is also called a set of twin prime numbers because both of them are prime numbers and the difference between them is, yes, 2. Similarly, a group like 17 and 19, this is also called 
twin prime numbers right and at the same time if I talk about 29 and 31 this is also a set of twin prime numbers and similarly 41 and 43 this is also a set of twin prime numbers right but if I write 7 and 11 this is not why because the difference between them is 4 if the difference is not equal to 2 then they are not called twin prime numbers they can be co-prime numbers because the common factor is 1 so all these groups can be called co-prime numbers but this 7 and 11 is not a set of twin prime number similarly 2 and 3 this is also not a set of twin prime numbers because the difference over here is 1 okay and 13 and 17 they also won't be referred as twin prime numbers right so I think now you understand what is twin prime numbers right so next is prime triplet and before going to that let me erase all this so the definition of prime triplet is a set of three consecutive prime numbers is called prime triplet right there is no restriction about their difference any set of three consecutive prime numbers can be called prime triplet so let's take one set two three and five this is a set of prime triplet and at the same time if we take 7 11 and 13 this is also a set of prime triplet so now you know what is co-prime number what is twin prime numbers and what is a prime triplet right so this is all in this video and after this I will be uploading few videos on many more interesting topics so keep watching MathSmart bye bye till then